Well, a lot of people think about the Andrews sisters as the superstars that they became. A lot of people don't realize how hard those girls worked for how many years. They traveled the country doing vaudeville, doing six and seven shows a day, trying to make ends meet. And for all of that hard work, they might bring home one dollar. Yeah. That's right. And they'd have to split it right down the middle. There you go. <laughs> Yeah, they used to have, They, uh, I heard that they had soldiers who would stop them on street corners, like two or three soldiers, you know, and they would do a show for them right there on the spot. They had those hearts. But they, um, their family traveled with them for years. Like their dad would drive them to shows, their mom would make their costumes, but after years and years and years of this, finally the family finances were drained, and their father came to them with an ultimatum. That's right. Peter Andrews came to his three girls, and he said, you know what? We, we have to have the big break. We need to get a hot hit right now, or we're going to have to head back on up home to Mound, Minnesota, because that is where their family is from. And you know what? He told his three daughters that they would be attending secretary school. By golly. <laughs> that was their plan B. That's right. Well, luckily for all of us, that day didn't come because a little song did come along and it changed everything for those girls. Does anybody out there remember the song by Mirabis Duché? Yeah? Okay, good. Does anybody know what it means? And the clapping stops. <laughs> yeah, oh, I love that song. Well, look. What's that? Oh, thank you. You don't look so bad yourself. <laughs> He said, you are beautiful to me. That's right. Uh, by me or Miss Duchesne directly translated means, by me you are beautiful. Aww. So there you go. Well, here we go. 1938, the song that changed everything. By me or Miss Duchesne. 